Okay, happy pie maker. Here's what it looks like on the front page. Very easy to use. I'll go to edit. There's where my simulator is going to be, but um, obviously I'm on basic plan, so it won't show up clearly. Scroll down, and you have options here on the first page suggested. People usually go for the form builder. There's social. Premium, if you pay for extra, can upload a video. Multimedia. Pocket tools is quite handy for calculators and all sorts. Contact page you can make. Again, they include basic features, even still. So, okay, that's the e-commerce page and this is the information page CRM I believe is related to informational database um, process that's database too so I'm not quite sure the difference between them I think one's Excel and the other one's access probably that they're using oh there's app sheet I think that's Excel as well where you can have all of the user information stored on your side okay and that's for you all very easy to um let me click on where's the oh yes i'll go back to the form builder and show you how easy it is to create a form so name you can change the icon choose a type of form so appointment is obviously a user can book an appointment here are the names of fields that you can choose i'll explain um, fields in a minute <coughs> right so inquire which is very simple um all the, your all the inquiries will be going to your email address as you enter it make sure you change the names custom is whatever you want to what kind of field you would like to insert and nested is obviously quite a few forms in one place uh, with this you have an option to con for the user to continue to the next step or um, submit so if you press if you if you choose submit then it won't go to form two. Right, so let's just go and have a look at um, custom one form. So if I want to change the data type, field type, you can click on any of these. Okay, and also regarding email you can actually have the user's email where's the email it's on here somewhere email 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 address the user can insert their um email address and if you want them to receive a copy there is an option here somewhere sorry this is Oh yes, and you can also edit the message you would like them to receive, how you would want them to receive it. Right, and there's the nested option, the other side. Okay, right. Yes, send inquiries confirmation to customer. Right, so that's the basics. I think that's got to do with data as well. You can change the form's style layout, which is amazing. Uh, new page, you can repeat the page, copy the page. And also, I want to show you the design customization side. They are very professional looking. 
here are a few more styles this is by the way the home page um just as one page so you have as you saw in the beginning there were many pages and they will appear like this as such so um basically what i'm saying is there is no home page the home page is basically all your pages that will be on this screen showing everything so you can't move from one page into the next page they'll just be as you see them all in one place as you sign in right so and that's it you can choose how you would like to view your current look at the moment so here are a list of my pages once again you can delete a form a page if you like by pressing the bin this is what i meant by all the separate pages will be allocated like this on one page this is the home page i have a sign in section a notification I clicked on preview and that's what my website looks like well with the website version back to editor right I'm gonna show you my mobile version app smartphone you can choose my one is currently on Android I've shown you the tablet version website and mobile you can see the mobile version obviously I've picked different pictures this time won't let me show my mobile version for some reason but um, you have to download whatever they tell you to um, in order to view what it looks like. and here is the basic 15 pounds per month gold 30 pounds and 48 pounds per month for platinum and this is what you'll get Again, like I said, some of the advanced features I've asked for and they, they don't include the advanced features that I'm looking for in the advanced sector. So, yeah, you really got to think about what you want and need.